Okay everyone, today I'm going to be crushing hot lava in my hydraulic press. This is going to be awesome. So I have here a bag of red lava rocks. I'm gonna melt these down at around 1200 degrees Celsius and I'm gonna stick the hot lava in my hydraulic press and crush it. So how I'm going to be getting the hot lava into the press is I'm going to pour it on this drywall in the molten state. And the reason I chose drywall is because drywall is made out of gypsum and gypsum won't burn. And another thing is it's soft. So that means that it's not going to crack and spill my lava or anything as the press puts pressure on it. It'll kind of just deform and squish out of the way and that's exactly what I want. So I'm going to pour my hot lava onto the drywall and I'm gonna have another drywall slab on top of the press and the two are going to press together and crush the hot lava. So this should be a pretty cool crush because hot lava when it's molten, it's actually pretty thick, kind of like thick honey. And so it should look pretty cool as the press comes down and squishes it out the sides. This is gonna be awesome. Okay, first let's get our lava rocks. These are red lava rocks. Okay, we are getting there. Look at that. <laughs> so the key to a forge is keeping as much heat in there as you can. I think we're ready. literally bubbling it's like bubbling okay come on Okay, here we go. Recording. Look at that. Yes. <laughs> Holy cow. Look at it just smush out the sides like that. That is awesome. <laughs> Let's open it up. Okay, here we go. <laughs> okay, let's see what this looks like. Ugh. This is gonna break. Better be careful. So you can see the hot lava. So this is the drywall that I use and it just totally got squished. Yes, we got it. That's awesome. You can still see it glowing on the sides there. <laughs> okay, I gotta peel off this drywall and see what this flattened lava looks like. That was so cool. That was awesome. Okay, this is the rest of it that I didn't get out. Still so hot in there. That is still so hot. Should 
probably put my gloves back on for this. Nice flat piece of lava rock here. So this is where it smushed out the side of the press. <laughs> See our lava we left in there now is cooled down. It's black now. So there were a lot of gas bubbles in there. It was actually so hot in my forge that it was bubbling. Look at this layer here. So you have the drywall on the bottom here and then this thin layer of lava here. So this is the lava that got smashed under the hydraulic press into this tiny sheet here. So these are the strings of lava that you saw when I put the crucible back in the forge. They're just glass-like now. Look at this, you can see how hot it was. This is one of the strings that came off of it. Look at that. Now I did a video before on bending rock. If you wanna see rock bend, look at this. That's so cool. So this is actual rock and look at it bend. It's like a needle made out of rock. It's so cool. I think I'm gonna save this. That was pretty awesome. Oh, whoa. That is hot. Holy cow. Come You got it. Break it off. Hey everyone, thanks for watching another episode of The Action Lab. I hope you liked it. If you did and you haven't subscribed yet, remember to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell to be notified when my latest videos out. And leave me any questions, comments, or suggestions that you have in the comments section and I'll try to get to them. And head over to theactionlab.com if you haven't checked out the Action Lab subscription box. These are boxes where you can do experiments similar to the ones that you see me do on my channel. And thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time.